Hey everyone, it's Brian from Pony Hills Hyundai. In today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at the 2022 Hyundai Ioniq. And what we're gonna be focusing on is the climate control system. All right, everyone, taking a look at the new display for the 2022 Hyundai Ioniq. When you look at the climate control system, you'll notice that it's all now in a beautiful flush uh, black with the illuminating blue buttons. Um, now, I wanna go over each side, that way we can uh, know exactly what each button does. So, when you take a look at the um, left side, you'll notice that you have the blue and red. Uh, those are indicators for both cold and hot. So, when you have the car on, or when you have the air conditioning on, you can, uh, you can choose whether you want it colder on one side or hotter on the other. So I'm gonna demonstrate that now by just simply turning on the air. Now you can turn on the air both by the screen up here and you can turn it on just by simply pressing any of these buttons. So I'm gonna turn it on here just to show you. Now you'll notice that it shows the illumination. It says low on both sides uh, because you do have the ability to change an air conditioning setting from either the left side or the passenger side. Now what you would do, um, for example, right here we like it maybe let's just say we like it a little bit hotter on our side we would tap this here and it'll move the uh, air conditioning to a little bit of a hotter temperature um, in order to have it to where you can do it on both sides you're going to turn off the sync button now that button is located up here at the top right you're going to press that now that you press that if i wanted to make it colder on my side you can see how only one side moved um, again, in order to use the air conditioning system, you can touch the fan or you can press auto. So the auto will have the air conditioning set to whatever automatically is set to. And to turn it off, right here, this off, you press that there. Um, to make sure that you have the AC on, you can tap that up there, same icon. And uh, lastly, for that top section, you, you'll see you have the option to have the fan uh, pointed at a certain way which is going to be it'll show you here in the illumination uh, towards your feet and uh, body or you could have it to just feet or you could have it to just body um, you have different settings for that now something really really neat for uh, the hybrids is going to be the driver only which is going to be located at the bottom left corner uh, you'll see that when driver only is on let's just say we had the air on on both sides if it was just me and i wanted to save a little bit of gas all you would do is you'd press the driver only and the whole right side would shut off for the air conditioning system and only the left side or the driver's side would stay on uh, which is a really really neat feature um, going back there are front uh defroster uh, and in the rear as well and you'll notice that you have the front on the left side and then the rear on the right side uh, that is something that again i uh, just wanted to make sure that you guys were aware of uh, lastly you have the um the option to both use the um, air that's displayed already inside the car uh, to have it fluctuate throughout the vehicle or you can use the air from the outside and you can see that you can choose at any point. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching today's video. If you have any other questions or concerns, please leave them in the comments section below. Thank you so much for watching.